Welcome back from big fireworks displays to backyard sparklers. Many of us will enjoy fireworks this weekend. Chemical Kim is here now to show us the science behind them. I love it. Oh I'm my gosh. Yes, put, put on my glasses. glasses on. Yes, yep. Catherine. And I have to say, this is the first activity I have brought into the studio that definitely you cannot do at home. This is definitely a, one that involves, um, you know, big safety issue. I have burning alcohol um, with salts, mm -hmm. but it's to show and talk about the science behind fireworks. Mm -hmm. Really, Which really is fun an stuff. Interesting study, but again, exactly. guys, this is not for home. Yeah, and don't I think what we're going to do is dim our lights a little bit so you can get the full effect. That's right. Of what because this is going to look like. You wouldn't want to put fireworks on display at daytime, right? No, you want no. it's for nighttime. Yeah. Okay. Two things about fireworks. One is that you get to see this really, really amazing, amazing bright. And this will take a second here, but amazing bright. Bright, 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 bright. <laughs> the fans in the studio bright light. make it impossible. Right. We'll try this one again. Okay. Bright light. Okay. And there's a couple of things that I'm going to demonstrate here is that yes. um, one here. Well, we'll just get started on this. Okay. Um, is that, of course, with fireworks, you're dealing with fire. Yes. And when we um, burn salts, they burn at Here, I'm going to help you too. Yeah, go is, ahead. This, we were worried about we're being working outside. In them. Yeah, in the wind in the well, studio. Well, we have That's air good. conditioning heavy duty in here. Okay, some of these, what I have are salts in, contained in alcohol. Okay, and what's unique about this is that when salts burn, they get excited and they change um, colors based on the excitement oh, that one didn't of help. the atoms contained in the salts. Yes. Okay, and it'll take a second here, but what we're going to see are different colors that start to get emitted from the burning of the salts. Yes. And that's what we see in fireworks. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's really and this actually goes hand in hand too with look at see how the green the green is beautiful. Okay. So and I have the red. Like, there's the red. Right, exactly. So I have copper, I have lithium, I have boric acid, I have a potassium salt, I have right you remember all this, right? Right. Sure. Keep a, keep a note here. Yeah, this is like a combo. <laughs> exactly. Oh my gosh, Catherine, wonderful, wonderful. Catherine's so smart. We do have a combo. We have a copper and a strontium combo. Look at that. Okay, awesome. And then we have a strontium and a lithium combo, blue and red. So okay. this is how they get the fireworks that blast the multicolors. They mix in those chemicals. Yes. Into their got exactly. It gets packed in these these atoms of these salts get excited and then they emit this light. And oh, that's right. how fireworks work. Okay. And then the other fun fun thing about fireworks is the spark effect. So we get yes. to be a little Harry Potter. And what I want you to do is just go ahead and splash it into the fire. <gasps> Look at that. Love it. Isn't what, that amazing? So this is what's sparkling on yes. a sparkler. Yes. Watch, watch. Ready? Here we go. Mm -hmm. I'll do it on this one. This red. Beautiful, beautiful red. Okay. Got a close up. Look at that. It, it feels almost like you're just sort of, you know, throwing that flu powder right into the chimney. But That's very as I cool. mentioned, you know, you know, with the Eclipse movie, and there in the in book one, there's mention of a beechwood fire, uh -huh. and the colors in the beechwood. Well, that comes from the salt water, uh -huh. all the metals in the salt. Magical, Catherine. Magical. I could do this all day. I love it. I got a little pyro in me. Beautiful. Now, what I was attempting, and maybe I will utilize one of the flames here since it's hot. What I was attempting to do yes. is ignite this piece of magnesium. Okay, yes. and magnesium it's is the a most metal. Ill-behaving piece of magnesium right I've ever there. seen. Right there. There okay, we go. There we go. And see how bright that is. Yeah. And the emission of light. And is that that's in? Oh, isn't yeah, that that's beautiful? Blinding. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. I mean, this is definitely fun chemistry. Chemistry that is, you know, very, very dangerous. So again, you wouldn't want to do this at home. But it gives you an understanding of how fireworks work. It's Amazing. very, very Fine. cool. Well, keep the sparklers coming. And thank you, Kim, so much for the lesson. And you can find more activities from Chemical Kim on our website, WZZM13.com, under Take 5 Links. Let the lights return.